Ah, nice day here. Good morning. So today's job, I'm got to batten off all this roof area for the ceiling boards to go on. That's the plan of action for the day. Solar panel still working. Excellent. Charging my phone again. Happy days. Here's all my wooden battens. They're going to get measured, cut to size on my trusty old workbench, aka pallet truck fork. Got a bench there, but. Oops. So there's the first one in. These ones I got pretty lucky with, with the hole lines up exactly. And that M5 rib nut go in. Put a bolt that in place. Screw that on so it's going to be the same right along here. Probably a wee bit different at the back. I've got different stuff going on at the back. But this is an off cut with the boards I'm using. And they shall go on like so. And I'll pre drill holes to fix them onto the battens. And I'll put more insulation in the middle here. Rib nut gun, M5 rib nut. If you don't know how these work, it compresses. And then behind that, the hole, the area where it goes in, and it gives you something fixed and secure to put your bolts into. There you go, see? And that screws in. So you don't need a bolt behind it. That's what the rib nut effectively is. That's all my batting straps in. So now I will have a couple of lights here, so I'll run my wires under here for the lights. Over to, that's for the lights there. That's already in place, that's the junction box for the power. And then I shall cut my boards out of this stuff to size. I've got a bit of polystyrene for insulation. Just got to put that in there, not that first. Everything will help. And that's this part of the roof done. Double check my measurements. Measure twice, cut once. I have got the table saw and I've got the rip saw, but sometimes I just like to do stuff by hand. That's why I was cutting that with an old school saw. So there is a bit of a preview of what it's got to be. That's nice wood, that'll look good up there. That is a test run, trial fitted, looks good. Mark where all the screws are got to go. These will be getting kept in obviously it's coming back out. i put markers where the lights have got to go. So I'll pre-drill the big holes for the lights, they'll go in. I'll probably sand it and then give it a wee stain before I put it back on. That's these lights put in place, got the remote here, on, 100% brightness, 50, 25, it's hard to see because it would bright as feck outside, party mode, nice, not that they'll ever be on like, maybe at night just for it to be cool but, then Back to light again. Excellent. Now before I fit the roof part on here with a light above the bed, we've got more of this carpet stuff. Got to trim the here, trim along here, possibly there, but I might build a wee something for in there. Trim these bits. I'll show you I've got it here. We've got plenty of this. And it's got to go in the panel and it's going above the bed as well.
put the light in place, just got to put the wiring up there before the panel goes screwed up. 